Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today I'm bringing you a 2024 Volkswagen Tiguan SEL R-Line 4Motion. This particular one is Atlantic Blue on the exterior. Atlantic Blue Metallic with Titan Black leather interior. It features keyless entry on two doors, LED headlights, LED turn signals and reverse lights, an LED light bar on the front, R-Line badging on the sides and on the front grille. 20 inch machine black and silver alloy R-Line wheels, body color cladding below the chrome line, also on the bumper, quad faux exhaust tips at the base of the bumper with an oversized reflector. It says Tiguan right below the Volkswagen logo there. And it says SEL off to the left and 4 Motion off to the right, right there. This one also has a black bumper dillo that's kind of hard to see with the dark blue color but it's right there to protect your bumper. Always a great recommendation on a car if your car doesn't come with one of those to get one. Silver roof rails, silver window surrounds, that nice sharp line down the side, end of the door handles and end of the R-Line badge right there. Body colored mirror caps with integrated turn signals and those are also power folding mirrors. As we open this up here, you have this metallic, this wood grain finish right here with an LED light bar across the top as well. You can kind of see a little hint of red right there. Also, you have a contrast stitch, three bands right here in the door inset and a single band down here on the arm pad, silver tips on the window switches, power folding mirrors, uh, the buttons right, or the icons right there for it. And then you also have heated mirrors, a power lift gate. You can do remote lift gate opening from the driver's seat here or a contactless pickup. And then you just lift up and hold until the, the door closes. And that's how you close it. Down here, stainless steel scuff plate with a backlit white light right here. It says R right there for the R line. You do also have three seat memory right here. Power forward and back and seat back adjust here. Power lumbar right here. Seat back adjust there. There's gray piping on the seat right here. And a nice contoured seat here. It's heated and ventilated. Manually adjusted headrest right there. The contrast stitch comes down behind the shoulders joins with the piping here in the bolsters down the side and as we look through there's a look at the armrest and the two outboard seats there you also have piping on the those two seats and also that contour stitching there as we climb in here when the sun's going down we need some light so I'm gonna turn on some light here see if that helps and I'm also gonna open the sunshade there's a look at your digital cockpit there three main views there but I'll go over here and bring over nav uh, to the screen to help with the visibility of that as it comes up over here there's your dial screen there's your wide screen and then there's the crop screen so you have three main screens there I personally like the wide screen a lot of people like the dial screen but you can actually zoom in and zoom out by hitting up arrow or the down arrow right here also on this steering wheel, it's capacitive touch, so you just swipe to turn the volume up, swipe to skip to the next song, and just tap the view button to change the view there. It's a telescoping steering wheel. There's a lever right here. You can pull out, push in, raise it, lower it, lock it, set it. You also have the Volkswagen logo right here in the center, the steering wheel here, uh, that capacitive touch. All of those buttons are backlit. Your adaptive cruise control right there, and travel assist down below. You have the Sport Grip R-Line steering wheel here. Um, this is unique to the Tiguan. The uh, Golf R has a similar steering wheel. So does the GTI and the GLI. Uh, but it's a flat bottom leather wrapped steering wheel. It's also heated. There's your heated steering wheel icon right there. Um, you do also have automatic headlights. Coin box for storage right there. Stainless steel pedal caps down there if you can see those down below down there. And then uh, on the screen here, your fuel gauge is off to the, to the right right there. The red line signifies that this thing's is about out of gas. It's got 20 miles of empty. It did show us that on another screen. But as you have a full tank, these bars go all the way up to the top. Temperature gauge is over here to the left. You do also have the nice flat dash here. There's a little storage cubby up here. And then you have vents straight across, all the way across. That metallic wood grain panel finish right there. It continues into the door panel over there. This particular one does have an auto dimming home link mirror with three door garage door memory and a digital compass there. You also have a vanity mirror up above, a LED light there for those on both sides. 
and then whoops that one wasn't fastened in there and then of course your sunroof and sunshade slides right there so I can open the sunroof right here and I can swipe back to do this guy right here it's pop-up windscreen and that goes straight back also on this on this uh, stereo right here I'm gonna go ahead and close this sunroof so I have that right here uh, we're gonna put this in reverse the backlit shifter right here trajectory steering on this guy right here I can turn the wheel left I can turn the wheel right and the yellow line moves accordingly the green line signifies straight back the red line signifies where the bumper is you also have auto uh, I'm sorry uh, capacitive touch for your climate control right here heated seat on both sides touch once it's on high and medium and low and off same on this side you also have capacitive touch to slide for your temperature adjustments swipe swipe to the red uh, for warmer swipe to the blue for cooler cool there's a pretty cool setup there and you also have a fan setup right here vent setups you can bring them up on the screen right here your radio is AM FM and satellite with gesture control as long as you see your hand right there you can swipe it across just like that and then uh, that backup camera of course is very nice um, you can change what's displayed there as well um, or how it's displayed down below there's two USB C's right here that are backlit and then there's wireless charging down here as well Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are wireless on this car uh, and then there's your start button here e-brake right there just lift up to activate and then put your foot down on the brake and push down on that to release being this is all-wheel drive you have your drive modes here you have snow mode you also have eco normal sport and custom and then you have off-road and an off-road custom and an off-road custom is going to allow you to tweak different things here so um, you can play with that all you want that's pretty cool auto start stop shut off right here park assist on this one I just did a video on park assist on the Tiguan very nice and then you have a 360 camera as well this gives you a summary of all four cameras so you can touch left side right side front back roof so you can do that on either one and I'll go ahead and turn that off down here you have stadium seat style cup holders this one's a little taller than this one here and then you also have uh, the uh, coin storage right here there's a look at the storage bin right there it's deep but it's not huge but you can get something of you can get a lot of stuff in there the passenger seat is going to be power as well just no power lumbar you can move it forward back up and down and seat back adjust there bottle and cup storage over here and look at that door inset right there and then you do also have this one has locking lug nuts which are in the glove box there there's your manuals there tire warranties right there very nice there's a look at that giant panoramic sunroof again right there these seats are actually pretty comfortable let's take a look at the back seat this one comes in at 41094 extras on this one include 405 for um, the auto dimming home link mirror 296 for monster mats 275 for a third year of prepaid maintenance then you also have 173 for a bumper dillo 90 bucks for a roadside assistance kit and then 1350 for destination bringing you to that 41094 there's a look at the door inset here the contrast stitching and then contrast stitching on the arm pad here as well bottle and cup storage there here's a look at your seats here with that gray piping on the two outboard seats a fold down armrest in the middle here squishy yet firm and then it also doubles as a pass-through you push the button on top right there and you can pull that seat down there's a steel reinforcing plate in all three sections of this seat back here that's by design to protect your passengers from uh, cr uh, cargo racing forward at impact in a crash storage pockets here and also here and then you have a, a, a vent set up here little storage cubby here and a backlit USB-C connection there with a three-prong plug in I'm sorry not a three-prong plug in a 12 volt charger port right there there's a look at that bottle cup storage there again and the giant panoramic sunroof you have side lights off to the sides of the Tiguan here I'm wearing my KU socks today rock chuck Jayhawk pretty cool car seat hookups right here and here and then you have this the strap here to fold the seat back to recline a seat or fold it flat you have that on either side let's take a look at the rear hatch as a look at those 20 inch out alloy wheels and someone's looking for a car here's a look through the back 
panoramic sunroof right there. It's a true five seater setup here. Cargo blocks right here, rubber mat kit here, monster match right there, I'm sorry, uh, roadside assistance kit there, front license plate bracket. This one does also have underneath the floor a privacy cover right there. And there is your quick release subwoofer right there inside the spare. Seat pulls on the sides here, so you can pull on this guy here and that seat will release. Same with this side over here. That seat release, you just click it down in place. Bag hooks on either side. You have one there, and actually it's just one on that side, and you have a 12 volt charger port there and a recessed trunk light here, and none over here on this side. There's the button to close that hatch. It does have the easy kick, and kick open hatch, and it's an adjustable height. This car will come with a four year, 50,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty on it from Volkswagen. That's four years, 50,000 miles, and include three years of included maintenance and then also an additional uh three years free maintenance if you buy from me at bomberito st peter's now that's a local deal only those extra three years but if you buy from me you'll be able to get those if you're interested in this car give me a call 636-290-4257 and before i sign off remember you get a 10-year 200,000 mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty free of charge on every new gas powered volkswagen 10 years 200,000 miles if you're interested in this car give me a call 636-290-4257 636-290-4257. I'm on TikTok, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Resales Cars. Thanks a lot, guys. Stay safe, stay healthy, have a great day.